Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can open and use the calculator app on the iPhone 13 or the iPhone 13 Pro. Now first, let's swipe up at the bottom of your screen to go back to the home screen. And on your home screen, you can swipe down the control center. In here, there should be a calculator shortcut. So tap on that button. And this will open up the calculator app. Now, there should also be a shortcut on your home screen to open up a calculator right here. And if there isn't a calculator, you can also go to the app library and go to the utilities folder. In here, there is also a calculator uh, app shortcut. And you can also drag it onto your home screen if you want to quickly create a shortcut so that you can uh, access the calculator app quickly. Okay, so now if we open up the calculator app, the, the app is very basic. It's only got the plus, minus, multiplication, and division. And then it's got some percentage uh, function as well. But it's very basic calculator. You can't do much with it. Only perform basic operation uh, in portrait mode. So in portrait mode, you can say uh, print number, and then you can say multiplied. Um, if you make a mistake, so if you put in a number and you put in the wrong key, you can swipe across to delete that number. As you can see here, if I accidentally put in a wrong number, I can swipe back to delete that number and then I can re-enter a new number. Okay, so we can also rotate the phone to landscape mode. In landscape mode, we will open up some of the scientific functions and here you can use uh, some of the functions on the left hand side to perform a calculation so say so if you want to find a circumference of a circle uh, we can say um, we put in the radius so or the diameter so you can use the diameter as well so diameter is of 30 multiplied by pi and we press on the equal button and that will give you a circumference of a circle okay so uh, you can use the scientific functions over here otherwise in uh, portrait mod if you want to work out say you want to work out you want to give a 20 percent tips to someone after say in a restaurant or somewhere so if the meals uh, cost 80 dollars and you want to uh, give them some tips 20 percent tips then you can say 80 uh, plus 20 percent Equal, so we're going to give them an extra $16 tips and then we press an equal button and your total will be $96. Or you can say 80 times 1.2, that will give you $96 as well. And so that are the basic function of calculators. There's no memories or history. So you cannot go back to see the history of your calculation, which I find sometimes it can be useful to have a history so that you can go back and check on your calculation. But with this, uh, built-in calculator it doesn't have a history function and uh, basically when you um, press on the cancel button it will reset everything and start uh, from zero again and that's it thank you for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more videos